Yo, yo, Reds fam, what's going on? And welcome back to the channel. And welcome back to another MLB The Show video. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to earn program stars at a higher rate than what you would normally make. Before we get this video started, I just want to go ahead and give the credit to this to Gomes, my boy Gomes the Ledger. If you guys haven't heard of him, you guys probably have heard of him. He's a GOAT in the community. He's really good. He's really good at giving tips on how to kind of make stubs, how to make uh, XP faster, how to make program stars. He's also a pretty good, uh, pretty good player, so be sure to check him out in the comments down below. I'm going to be pinning his channel and also putting his link in the description because without him, I probably would not have gotten this and I'd probably still be probably by 60 stars or something like that. So yeah, what is the method you would say? Now, previously we had methods like retro mode, we had methods of the home end derby and stuff like that, and it worked pretty well until SDS figured it out and then pretty much it got patched. So those aren't as effective. You can still do them, but they're not as effective and won't pretty much be, it, it won't be worth your time. Now, there's been a new method that I figured out. Well, I have, excuse me, I didn't figure it out. Gomes, I figured it out since from from what I can see. And uh, I've been playing it for quite a while. So it does not include Diamond Dynasty whatsoever. You're gonna go ahead, before you do it, we're gonna set it up. I'm gonna go over to the vault. You're gonna go first to the roster vault. You're gonna go over to the roster vault. You're gonna go ahead and search. You're gonna go, well, here, new search. You're gonna put the online ID, Gomes the Legend, roster type all. You're gonna search, and it should be this roster. I already have it downloaded. You're gonna need this roster in order for this to work out. You guys are gonna see in a second why. So you're gonna go ahead and download this, and then you head on over to the sliders, and we do the exact same thing for both. Go to the roster, Gomes the Legend, online ID, all. You're gonna be search, and then in the sliders vault, the same thing, Gomes the Legend, online ID, and then search all. And you're gonna download this slider uh, slider right here. And it's gonna be very important. So now, how do we set it up? You guys go over to start new, you go over to load save roster, okay? You're obviously gonna load up the roster that you downloaded, the GDL XL. You're gonna go ahead and download that, and I'm gonna take you guys to which one that I've been doing. So basically, everybody is a 99 in the squad. Everyone's a 99. Well, not everybody, but basically, the majority of the players that play are gonna be 99 overalls, and these are the only ones that you should care about. And everybody else is gonna be at a very low overall. For the sliders, you're gonna go over to my sliders, the sliders that you have just downloaded. You're gonna go ahead and open them up. I'm gonna open them up because I'm gonna be doing it. And the whole goal of this is basically to play each game. Right, you're not gonna simulate, you're gonna have to play each game, but it is not as intensive as some people would think it is. It'll be intensive kind of because you you know the more games that you play throughout the season, obviously the more stars you get. So basically each game is basically gonna be a star. If you really think about it this way, each game is going to be a star because you earn about 2.2k XP per game. And from what I've heard is that 2k is pretty much an equivalent to one program star This is the best way now to get program stars in my opinion You're gonna go into the game you're gonna play it and then in this menu right here It's gonna take you here You're gonna go over to player lock and player lock over to the pitcher All right One thing that I forgot is you're gonna go over to your user settings, right? You're gonna go to presentation option and over here It's very important for you to have these on in order to get to in order for the games to be faster You're gonna go ahead and presentation mode gonna put fast play none for pre-pitch and then you're gonna put camera frequency rarely better walk off a uh, better walk up off so these are just gonna make everything just go by pretty quick and you won't get any more interruptions so now let's go back into the game and show you guys what to do so what you do here is basically you're just gonna throw fastballs in the corner I know it sounds very intensive and each game probably takes about seven or eight minutes Honestly, if you guys look over to Gomes' video, he's more in depth with it and he 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 lets you know the the pretty much the specifics of everything in this uh, in this process So I left that out because obviously I want you guys to see his video because he deserves, you know It's is it's his method So I'm gonna leave that out in order, and then you guys are gonna have to watch his video for it But um, yeah, it's basically the basics. That's all you're gonna do. It's gonna go over to this mode and just kind of throw man it's pretty simple you you don't really have to locate you could honestly just throw it in, towards the corner and they're not gonna swing the sliders are all pretty much juiced so that they can't really much they, they can't get a hit and your fielders are pretty are insane you also have the darren o'day uh pitching stance so that the pitching style so it'll be very fast you know pretty quick to get to to get the ball out there shouldn't take a while and yeah, that's all you do, man. I'm, I'm making this video for people that I've seen ask 
uh, how how do I get program stars pretty quick? How do I get program stars? Uh, so I want to make one on my channel, you know, with all, obviously all credits to Gomes. I, I'm gonna keep stressing that because I I know it's uh it's his method. Without him, I would not have made this video, and without him, we probably I probably would be stuck, like I said, on 60 stars. So you're gonna want to do this as many games as you can. I've done probably about 20 games, 20 or 30 games, probably even more. If you think about it, that's 20 extra stars that I've made just doing this, and I'm already almost 200. I'm almost i would say 70 percent of the way there i know it's still taking me quite a while because i haven't done any of the online missions i haven't done the uh, i don't have the voucher which is very important i don't have the voucher at all and yeah that's all you want to do so the whole game just go ahead and clock them down just chuck pitches strike them out and at the end you're gonna see your total of xp is uh it's it's gonna be about 2.2k it's usually about 2.2 it varies about how many strikeouts you get if you can get a lot of strikeouts it'll give you more if you get uh some ground outs should it, it i mean you'll get a little bit less but it shouldn't be a problem to be honest all right so as you can see i finished the game it it took i mean it doesn't take a while you know if you pop on a tv show that you watch on tv if you pop on some youtube videos it'll fly by really fast so yeah obviously you're gonna score a lot of runs because it's cpu is over a 99 overall so your team's gonna be good and you're gonna see the xp that you get here uh well i didn't see the xp but basically total of the xp is going to be about 2.2k you're going to get one program star so that's pretty much it folks if you guys want to make some program stars quick that is how you do it that is going to be it for this video folks if you guys enjoy it please make sure to leave a like down below and also drop a sub and i will see you guys in the next one all right peace